Hello everyone, my name is Danny. This review is for the movie called Light from Light. This is a 2019 film. It was released in November of 2019, so it's still relatively new. And it's, uh, does not look like it has a rating, but it does run an hour and 22 minutes. And it stars Marin Ireland, Jim Gaffigan, and Josh Wiggins. The description? A single mom and part-time paranormal investigator is asked to look into a possible haunting at a widower's farmhouse in East Tennessee. This is Light from Light. Well, hello everybody. Thank you for watching this video. Um, feel like it's a good time for a reminder if you would like to have any correspondence with me outside of YouTube I do have my Facebook page up and running I'm getting more likes almost every day and uh, past a hundred now on Facebook there it's called Danny's movies and music so yeah if you'd like to keep in touch with me and get to know me a little bit more and get some bonus content you can go there um, otherwise, I just hope everybody's staying healthy uh, during this time of the virus. I know things are kind of questionable, but uh, seem to be getting better in the summertime here. So, hope everybody's doing well, and uh, I thank you for you know taking some time out of your day to watch this video. Uh, this is kind of a different movie. Um, it just came to me from doing some research, you know, trying to see what's out there to watch. And I do that at the beginning of the month, every you know every month. So I'm always getting new movies like this. So if you'd like to follow me more, you know, I watch tons of new movies all the time. So uh, this is just one that kind of came to me, and um, I was able to watch it uh, the other night. And it was nice to see somebody I knew in this movie, Jim Gaffigan. But otherwise, everybody else just kind of seemed, you know, like this is just kind of a side project movie and it was a different idea and a different movie and I didn't know what to really think about it so um, the, the good thing about this movie I'll start there is that it has a lot of tenseness because it's about paranormal stuff I have friends in this world that are you know like they make their living out of that and so it's very interesting in that way which is great but it has a lot of problems throughout the movie and everything but it at least has that good moment at the beginning where it draws you in and it says hey this movie is about paranormal investigating and stuff and then it kind of withers as it goes on it starts to a seem not to be that big of a deal just kind of like a little fun project she even lets her kid help and his girlfriend and then you know not a lot happens they have some readings that are disappointing they have one thing happen they try to explain the whole thing away um, it just seems to not be in really important to anybody you know right away at the beginning of the movie I'm just telling you what happens okay Jim Gaffigan's character actually asks about what this is going to cost and she says nothing and when that happens I don't know it just kind of excuse me when that happens it just seems to kind of take the importance of the matter at hand and just kind of like make it not that important right away so as I said as the movie draws on it does wither away with excitement importance um, the acting just seems to not be on par because everybody just knows that this is kind of like not that big a deal, you know, okay, you know, this, whatever. Um, it's a little sad and emotional and they kind of play on that for, for the viewer, but I don't think it matters that much. And then the ending is 
the ending is neat but I just don't know if it's gonna carry people over the edge enough to care because the movie itself is just kind of it's it's interesting you know it has that really tense feeling at the beginning and then it just kind of goes and it's like okay um, I heard somebody say the other day on one of their reviews on YouTube that you know some movie felt like it was an hour and a half but it made it feel like it was three and a half hours and I would say that about this movie because it just seems to kind of go on forever and it has the same stuff happening but it just seems to keep going you know I mean and I know we have to have dramatic movies in this world and there's certain ways of handling drama movies you can't just have people just talking or just going to do this or going to do that and I think you can kind of tell that when you watch this movie that it's doing that it's just kind of plugging along so that's really what's wrong with this movie the ending is neat and interesting and it is an interesting reason to do a movie I was kind of excited to jump into this you know and it's kind of an interesting hobby and really a way of life for some people in this world so it can use more exposure as you know a hobby and a career and have people make movies about it the paranormal investigating stuff it doesn't always have to be somebody doing an exorcism of somebody you know but uh, yeah I'll just give this movie a C because I think it's interesting enough and it's not really bad it's just boring and it goes on and plugs along and it really needs to take that feeling from the beginning and carry that through the film that's really all it's really missing so uh, that's that doesn't make it a horrible movie so I'll give light from light a C and I do advise watching it it's it's interesting so we'll give it that thanks a lot guys my name is Danny if you like this or any of my other videos try and get some of them to watch like and subscribe to my channel if you would enjoy movies thanks